Do you mind? So, did you get the alarm? Yeah, yeah. And what are you going to do, play with that lock all night? Keep your shirt on, will you? You wouldn't want to try it yourself. Keep quiet, all of you. Wild sense of humor you got there, Warden. Yeah. Almost died laughing. Like if you ever foul up like this again, you'll die, baby, but you won't be laughing. Now, what was all that chatter about? So don't make a case. It was just a rehearsal anyway. Yeah, and you flunked it good. You sounded like a bunch of Boy Scouts on a camping trip. All right. You've had your fun and games. The next time it's for real. They won't be shooting blanks, and if you even breathe out loud, you're going to be dead. All of you. You had to open your big mouth, didn't you? And you just had to have a cigarette, didn't you? I can smell it all the way down the hall. I told you. I've been breaking and entering for years. Now it's about time you learn how to do it properly. You trying to teach me something, now knock it off! Now we've got three hours before we jump into Norway. Great. Gives us time for just one more run for it. You guessed it, Casino. Let's go. All right, now, this will be the last look you'll get of our man in the ground, so pay attention. Got it? Got it. Grab the lights. Active. Skyler Erland, leader of the resistance movement near Bremen. He was captured by the Germans three days ago. And imprisoned here. Chief. Once we get inside the joint, my job's to kill the alarm system at the back of the building. The idea. Casino. I pick the lock on the back outside door and then on the inside door. Here and inside. You have only 30 seconds. Yeah, no sweat. Actor? You, Cassina, and I will enter the security block. Dispose of the guard and proceed to Erland's cell. We we'll spring him and come back the way we came. Right. Any questions? Yeah. So when does my parole board meet? After the war. If you're still alive. I'll meet you below in 20 minutes. Pack your gear. Hey, how come we always got to jump somewhere? I mean, aren't there any boats going to Norway? There's a war on, stupid. Boats can get sunk. Yeah, well, how about that? You know, I got some information for you. I have actually heard that airplanes get shot down in a war. What's the matter with you, Casino? Don't you like your work anymore? Crazy about it. I just don't like jumping out of airplanes. So go tell the warden you quit. Yeah. You volunteered. Go back to Leavenworth. Volunteered nothing. I was coerced. I was looking at a ten-year stretch for safe cracking when the warden broke me out. How would you like to do a little traveling for the government, he says. Well, try to keep your sense of humor, old boy. What's funny about jumping 2,000 miles in the crop territory to break into a lousy prison? The irony of it. What do you mean? Just think of all the time and effort they spent in getting us out of prison. So that now they can ask us to break back into it. There. That's hilarious. Yes, it is. Well, cheer up, mate. It could be worse. Don't worry, baby. It will be.
Do you think I'll pass? For a garbage collector? Anytime. Funny. I still don't see why I couldn't have been a German soldier. I tell you what I'll do. You take my uniform, and I'll stay here. Funny. I must give you the name of my tailor. Terrible fit. Just terrible. You live. Unfortunately. I only hope that I don't run into anyone I know. So do I. Actually, I've never been here in Drummond before. Now, also something else. I knew a girl there once. Katerina. Here we go. She was one of the great beauties. Mm. You ought to learn to knock, buddy. Yes, I'm sorry. Tucker, it's no trouble. All right, we're right on schedule. Let's move on. How do I look? Hmm? Thing of beauty and joy forever. Appearances are very important, you know, particularly in my work. Oh, yes, I know. Me too. After you. Thank you. Hey, actor. You're sweet. Grading what one has to do in the line of duty. Come on, let's move it. Come on, Chief Heath. Close your eyes, mate. It will seem just like solitary. Can it? Can it? Leave the jokes to me, would you, mate? Yeah, Warden. Here to bid
Chief? Well, we haven't had time to get to the arms system yet. It might be a break. On the inside? Get the rest of the cans back in the truck. I'm going back after the chief. Thanks for bailing me out back there. Forget it. Hey, the nerve of those guys. Trying to break out when we was trying to break in. What do you expect? Every time we try to pull a job, something gets fouled up. What'd you find out? 
Blake had nothing to do with Erland, but they have moved him into a new cell block for maximum security. And they have doubled the guards. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Well, that blows it. Come on, let's get out of here. For once, I agree with you. No, we just got to find another way. What, are you kidding? We don't stand a chance of busting that can again. Breaking into the big time? Warden, look at this. Who's the colonel? Prison commandant? Yes, Colonel Manfrelink. The boy is his son. Willen? Ja? Dein Vater sagte, du bleibst mit mir heute. Haben du Bonbons? Oh ja, natürlich. Viele Bonbons. Oh, gut. Und wir werden spielen. Ja? Komm mit mir. Komm. Hey, what's his name? Willen. And he's a very good boy. He knows his father wants him to stay with us for a while. Wilhelm? You, Wilhelm? Yeah? Hey, I'll call you Willie, right? Willie. I had an uncle named Willie once. He was the best cat burger in London, he was. Here, Willie, which hand? Hey, come on, the kid doesn't understand. Of course he does, don't you, Willie? Come on, which hand? The right one. Man is a magician. His father come back yet? Yeah, he drove in a few minutes ago.
Mann Freiling hier. Ob ist Mann Freiling? Ja. Ob ist? Er ist Herr Wilhelm. Und er ist unverletzt. Maschen. Wilhelm. Wilhelm. <lacht> Nun auch ist, hören Sie gut so. Ja. Ja, ist gut. Did you agree to meet? Yeah. Do you think we can trust him? Do you speak English? Yes. Where's my son? Don't worry, he's all right. He's uh, he's quite safe, Colonel. Believe me. What is it you want? A prisoner. Who? Skyler. Ireland. It's impossible. It's a simple trade, Colonel. Ireland for your son. No. Even if I wanted to, I couldn't. Let's find out. Nobody needs to find out, Colonel. You arranged to have Ireland transferred. Transferred? Tell them you're worried about prison security, then give me the route. We'll take care of the rest. We all have to do things we don't like, Colonel. Sometimes we have no other choice. All right. Oh, thank you. And thank you for the beautiful dinner. Well, become me. I hope it is smacked it. Oh, it's smacked a lot. <laughs> ah. I'm stuffed. Hmm. You're kidding me. You only ate enough for three people. Home-cooked food. Nothing like it. And when this is over, I'm going to settle down. I'm going to find myself a nice little cook. Yeah? Three days later, we'll be right back in the clink. Ours has ten men, some with German uniform. I will be moving Ireland at dawn. Along this road here to the border. We intercept them here. What about the boy? Well, as soon as we get our man, we'll let the boy go. All right, you've got five hours to wait. Get some sleep.
Yeah. Well, uh, I thought the kid might be cold. Well, besides, I don't need no blanket. You know, wait the others up. It's time to leave. Das ist gut. Weitermachen. My men are in position. I think I'll be here any minute. Wir haben Minen gefunden. Garrison, Allied Intelligence. Are you okay? Fine. I'm glad you're here. Hey, listen, we better get out of here. There's a farmhouse on the other side of town. That is safe. Hey, what about the kid? Uh, we were holding the Commandant's son until we got you. There? At my house. I'll go back now and let the boy go. The rest of you go with Erland. and skirt the town. How will you find us? I will send one of my men with you. Johansson! <laughs> Picture you different. Of no consequence. You've caused me to disgrace myself. You forced me to make a decision no soldier should ever be forced to make. You use me 
Now I intend to use you. You will tell me all about your friend. Two out of three. I got long your quarter. All right. All right. They got Garrison. What happened? The kid got away. The colonel was waiting for the warden when he walked in. They took him to prison. So what are we going to do? Well, we can't stay here, can we, mate? You're not kidding, we can't stay here. You know where we got to meet that sub? Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. And hey, what about the warden? What about him? You guys just gonna leave him? No, he said it himself, didn't he, mate? We're all expendable. Yeah, he knew the odds. He wasn't thinking of the odds when he bailed me out. Of course, there is another way to look at it. What's that? What happens if we go back without him? We go straight back to prison. I say we try. Yeah, yeah, all right, but saying and do it are two different things. I mean, you're not going to bust back into that place now with an army. Right. Yeah, well, you got some ideas or something? What? Yeah. There is one way. Well? It won't be easy. Partisanen getötet. Was soll ich mit ihnen tun? Wir ernähren them. I get to be the private. Because you got to have class to be an officer. I must confess, the inside of that prison is the last place I ever wanted to see again. Yes, I am. It'll be dark by the time we'll get Garrison out. That may help us. Major Kaufmann, we have a partisan in Führer. I will open my frilling zane sofort. On a paper? I have sofort gesagt. It's a befehl, Herr Major. wanted to see our passes. <laughs> Most Germans are trained to obey, not to think. Bark in order and their discipline completely dominates any thought of question. Hey, what did he say? He said you always get in, if you're SS, baby. Knock it off. Erland, we'll have to be right. Was soll das? 
Obersmann Freuling? Ja, Major Kaufmann. Vor einer Stunde haben wir einen Partisanenführer gefangen genommen. Sie haben einen anderen Partisanen, einen Amerikaner. Bringen Sie ihn. Robert. Mann, Freeling, hier. Bringen Sie den Amerikaner her, zu mir. Super. Ich möchte bitte Ihre Papiere sehen. Glauben Sie mir nicht? Abtreten. What is your name? Garrison. Lieutenant. 926314. An American. Do you know this man over here? Answer me! Did you kidnap that German officer's child? Answer me! Answer. Yes. Did the colonel agree to let you recapture the resistance leader in return for his son? Ich bestehe darauf, Ihre Papiere zu sehen. Ich habe nichts zu verlangen. Ich habe das Recht, Ihre Papiere zu sehen. He wants to see my papers. And I don't have any. Very clever man. But you still have to get out of here. That shouldn't be difficult with your help. Oh, no. Not a second time. You can shoot me if you want to. That might be an excellent solution, Colonel. We would simply tell everyone of your part in Ireland's escape. We'd say that you resisted arrest and we had to shoot you. Of course, your name, your family would be disgraced. But that is entirely up to you. All right. Your gun.
You almost blew the mission, bring him back into prison. Besides getting yourselves killed. You'd never go out on a lamb for one of us. Good, Lieutenant. That was different. You were trying to con us? Warden. Oh, 